And excuse my hair in this vlog, y'all. When I tell y'all, your girl, listen, my parents don't get me paid. My hustle gets me paid. So I don't know what to tell nobody that is offended by my hair or the fact that I only get dressed when I'm going somewhere. Gang, it is your girl Journey of Queen Quan, also known as who your favorite YouTuber's favorite YouTuber, baby. And I am back, back, back with another banger. So, as you guys can see by the title of this video, told you guys we are turning up the hustle on this her game, guys. I was not playing with y'all. I gave y'all enough charms, I gave y'all enough little package orders, all that good stuff. Now it's time to go ahead and focus on our focus, and this is our year. So, I went to my storage. And um, I got some boxes and stuff out of there, but I did not tell you guys that I had gotten a box that I have um, that has my wigs in it that I pre-made, some of them my color, stuff like that. So we just gonna go through this box, and in this video, um, I am going to pick two of these wigs to um, go ahead and flat iron on camera, and then they are going to I'm gonna take some pictures, and they're gonna go up on the site, y'all, because they're gonna be ready to ship. So I told you guys I had a big announcement coming about my. Um, my wig collection, right? So here is the gag. Your girl is about to have ready to ship wigs. So all of the wigs that I have left on my website, I'm going to slowly be taking them down unless they are sold and turning them into ready to ship wigs. Now, what I mean by ready to ship, they are wigs though. Wigs, guys, not hand sewn. You'll see the difference. If I make some that are hand sewn, you will know because it'll be in the description box. But they are wigs. So that means I'm going to show you guys how they are going to come. But they are going to be ready to ship. So slowly but surely, I'm going to be taking them down. I'm going to be customizing them. When I say that, I mean bleaching the knots, plucking a little bit of the hairline. Um, Baby hairs may or may not be on there. It just depends on the styling of the wig. Maybe I'll do that with the wet and wavy kind. Um, But straight, no. I'll just go ahead and pluck it and, you know, style it and things like that. So that was what I wanted you guys to know about my, um what I wanted you guys to know. <laughs> I got so excited, y'all. That was what I wanted you guys to know about my wig collection. So, yeah. And also this year, y'all, I am going to work on, I promise y'all, I'm going to work on slowing down when I talk because <laughs> some of y'all be like, huh? Run that back. Or y'all can't really understand me because I talk so fast. But it is what it is. I'm sorry, y'all. And excuse my hair in this vlog, y'all. When I tell y'all, your girl, listen, my parents don't get me paid. My hustle gets me paid. So I don't know what to tell nobody that is offended by my hair or the fact that I only get dressed when I'm going somewhere because if I'm bumming and bumming or moving around, your girl is just basic Betty, just cooling. You see what I'm saying? But the thing of it is, is I use this time to position myself, not put myself out. You know what I'm saying? Um out here to be seen and all that kind of stuff just by regular smegular people i want to be seen by the right people and you guys are the right people or so i think i don't really know i'm just kidding <laughs> i'm just kidding i'm just kidding but my appearance y'all y'all just gotta excuse me for today i'm just straight like today is sunday by the time you guys see this vlog it will probably be like thursday or something because i have like two i have three vlogs already in store for you guys two of them is charms and one of them is um a trip to the storage so by the time you guys see this one probably be like thursday or friday or something of this week so let's just go ahead and i'm, a, I'm not gonna do much blab and i'm gonna let y'all know right now what you guys are about to see i'm gonna we're gonna go through this box and then after that your girl is going to go ahead and set it up to where i can pick the two i'm gonna go ahead and flat iron them out take the pictures of them i will insert the pictures at the very end to show you guys how they look so let's just go ahead and see hey, what we got in this box girl it is oh my god yeah. <laughs> I got so, yeah, when I tell y'all, I would be so much further along in my hair game had I, look at this. Y'all didn't even see all of them that fell out. Just look, it's some more. I had to kind of like tilt it. All right, so let me see this. Do this, let me, this might help y'all out a little better. This might help all of them. There we go. Okay, so I had to move back a little bit more. So then went this way, you guys can actually, like, see what we got going on here. All right. Now, mind you, these are, like, almost two years old. 
Like I've had these up on my website. I've taken them down. I've washed, conditioned. I've done watercolor on some of them. So we just gonna go through them real quick <laughs> and see. Real and like I said, I'm gonna choose two, and these two are going to go up on the website. Um, and they will be affordable. And yeah, so let's just see. What, what is this? Oh, this was from. <laughs> This is my natural way from when I had my quick weave in. That's what that is. <laughs> Let's see. Uh-oh. Hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it. Hold it, hold it, hold it. This is a bob cut wig. Comes with the clippies. Boom, boom. And the adjustable bands. Boom, boom. And it was the bang yang yang. <laughs> it's the bang yang yang. So that's that one. And this was done with um, I actually I don't know if I took that video down. That was one of them old goofy videos I did when I first started, y'all. So this um watercolor method thing might be on there. That's what I was saying. So that was one of them old goofy videos I did when I was way out of my element. And matter of fact, I don't even no, I'm, I know which one I had on. It's not this one. I was going to say I had on one in, in one of my videos. But so we got this one. This is a good candidate right here. Ready to ship. What else, what else do I need to do besides flat ironing and make it look cute on the picture? Yep, so we got that one. <laughs> All right, what's this? Oh, this was mine for personal use. I don't know. I think I had this on in one of my vlogs. Or some pictures or something. I don't know. Y'all can figure it out. <laughs> I had this was when I was first learning how to do elastic bands, y'all. So I had this thick old elastic elastic band in there. Bam, and I had these combs. I put in there too. So this was for personal use. It was actually all brown, and then I just kind of dumped it in the bleach and just let it do what it do. So. I can definitely rejuvenate this one and bring it back to life. Some water and conditioner, baby, and your girl will be back on. What's this? Oh, this is a frontal yeah I had that I never sold. It's never been worn or anything either. I'm like, what is this? It's a 12-inch frontal. I might have to put this up on a uh, marketplace or something. I did bleach the knots a little bit, but... I might have to put that up on Marketplace. See what's going down with that. Throw that over to the side. <laughs> yeah. What's this? Oh, this was personal use also. I'm not sure if I have. Oh, I actually have a vlog on this one. A video on this one. How to. So if you guys want to go back and see how I created this look. I did it on camera. And it was just to show, you know, how well and evenly that um, the color will come, the bleed, the lightning process would come out on it, honestly. It wasn't for nothing. Like, I can take this and dip it in um, watercolor, like red or anything, and go from here if I wanted to. <laughs> I got an idea. I might. But, yeah. So, that's that. That was personal use. I'm pulling these babies back out. I just got excited. <laughs> yeah, I'm telling y'all, yeah, I, I have, this is my year with this hair game. I'm telling y'all, y'all gonna look, I ain't gonna keep on telling y'all nothing. I'm just gonna show y'all. But anywho, so this is, oh, okay. This was one of my first wigs that I got from my vendor to test out the quality of it, the density and all of that. And this one was only like 150 I wish I would have gotten it fuller because once I got it, it did look a little bit thin on the ends. And I do not like thin hair. But I did lighten it and do all of that good stuff just to um, see what it would do. And this is what it do. So that's a lot. I might have to. I'm going to get this to my mama. She, 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 uh, um, no, I shouldn't have said that on camera because if she watched it, she going to be waiting for it. And I might not give it to her. I might do something with it myself now that I'm more savvy on how to style them. All right, let's see. Bang, bang, bang. This is a wig. Now, this one I did watercolor on. No, I take that back. This one I actually did. Um, I used Revlon products on this one, guys. And what I did was I went through and just, um, I was going for like an ash blonde. So I just went through with the Revlon and 
boom, boom, boom. And this is what it came. Matter of fact, this was done on 613 hair. So I don't want you guys to think that I lifted the hair all the way to this. And, it, and I mean, blonde. but um, no, I didn't do that. It was already 613 when I purchased it from my vendor. So this is a bob cut whatever whatever i don't know we're gonna we're gonna hook it up though we're gonna see what we got going on so yeah this is definitely another candidate she gonna need some loving though so we got this one now this was done uh -oh, on 613 watercolor method and i had the dark roots so that's that bang 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 this is a wig i mean a unit i'm sorry and so boom 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 so we might have to bring this one back what's this oh this is for me cutting off of a wig <laughs> and doing an install on my own hair Stands. Oh, oh, hey girl, hey. This is loose wave, a whole wig, y'all. I'm taking this down. Y'all gonna matter of fact, y'all gonna see me put this in my hair. This was a wig that I had did. Um, I call myself gonna wear it, and then I don't really know what. Oh, it went in the storage. That's what happened. But it has never been worn or anything, and this was made out of our loose wave hair. And I do not recall the inches that were used, but girl, listen, I'm just as crazy. Let me see. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. It won't be this big, but my hair will not be this big. This loose fat. Yeah, I know I got this hair under her. But, um, yeah, and I handmade this, y'all. Like, my hand made this. Of course, it ain't going to lay or look right because I got this. But, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this down, though. I'm not going to wear no wig. I'm going to take it down and um do me a, whoa. I'm going to do me a, um either a sew-in or a quick weave with it. Either or. Yes. Never even been worn before, so we're going to do that. That's going with me. That is not going to be part of this little, you know. So, yeah, throw that over there. And what is this? Oh, this is, y'all got to excuse me. Don't do what I do. I keep telling you, I do better than me. This was a quick weave that I had in. <laughs> this is still on the cap, but we're going to take um, it. Yeah, we're going to make something happen with these tracks. <laughs> yep. We got that. It's some more over here, y'all. Yeah, I told y'all. All right, what's this? This is a unit. I will be redoing this one and the blue one because these caps that I used, it was like trial and error. I was trying to find lighter caps. But what I realized is um, I had like two people who had ordered wigs for me. Um, they stretch easily. They were not thick like the other dome uh, caps that, that people normally use. Well, at least that's what they... Uh... Yeah, that was it. I just had to make sure that was the right one because I remember using it. Yeah, this one and this one. But... What I was saying was, y'all know the thicker the thicker caps that people normally use. See, these were more stretchy, like they they weren't the right ones. Told y'all, girl, trial and error is going to be your best friend. Trial error, try it out, make an error, do it over. <laughs> it's okay. It's not a race. Jesus, nobody's gonna pass you by. You're in. For Christ's sakes, remember? Get y'all. So this was the same one now. What's oh, this is just a regular smegular track? All right, so this was oh. worn. Um, I worn I wore this for maybe like a week, and then I never put it on my head again. So I don't know. Maybe this go up 
on another app or like marketplace or something after I hook it up. It has uh the adjustable bands and the combs. So yeah, and I cut the lace off of it. Pre-cut lace. All ready. So girl, you ready to go? <laughs> All ready. <laughs> you ready to roll, baby? So we gone. This is this one is uh questionable as to will will it go on my site or will it go up on another site? I told y'all I got stuff all over the place. Y'all better get it. Y'all better get on marketplace. Y'all better do Poshmark. Y'all better get on Mercury. Y'all better get it popping, baby. I'm telling ya. Y'all do not just have to use Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook or TikTok to get them sales, baby. But it's all to the G. We all right. So now that we let me stay up, focus on my focus. Yeah, I know I'm gonna left on y'all real quick. All right. So now that we have that done, what I'm going to do is I am going to set up to take two of these and take two of these wigs, and I am going to flat iron them, bring them back to life, take a couple pictures, and they are going to go up on my website. Like, what am I gonna sit around and wait for and twiddle my thumbs? I have no reason. I have to get to it. I told y'all it's going down. So let me get focus on my focus, which is these wigs right now. And then I am going to come back at the end and show y'all. Like y'all get to see me flat iron them all there real quick. Because I want to show y'all how um how well the hair takes heat, etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera. And then um I don't have any of them little cute little mannequins that everybody got going around. My mannequin ain't all dolled up and all that. My mama old school. She got the, you know, the beauty supply ones. Boom, boom, boom. That you can get for like five bucks. Yeah. We gonna use them and take some nice little cute pictures. Um, Got my fuzzy brug. I got my little setup. Yeah. I'm gonna see y'all in a minute. <laughs>
right, butterfly babe. So here are the finished products. Like I said, these were old wigs, but guess what? They are ready to go, baby. Never have been worn. They are available on our website. For those of you that don't know much about what I was doing with that little razor thing, for the blonde one, the ash blonde one, the plan was to put texture into the wig so that it's not so stiff looking. As I told you guys, I used Revlon on that. So that hair coloring is a little more harder on the hair and will require a little more maintenance. So that's what I was doing, putting some texture into that wig. So that way, whoever purchases it can just sling it from back to uh, from side to side, honey, front to back, and have a nice little flow in their hair. Their hair don't look stiff. The game plan with all. that wig was to do exactly what I did, to make it uneven, to have a choppy effect, and make it so that it's not so calculated. Because some people like that look. They do not like a stiff looking cut and cut all straight across. Now with the other one, y'all already see what she looking like. So yeah, thank you all so much <laughs> for watching this vlog. As I told you guys, I am going to be turning it up in this hair game this year. So I hope you all like this video. Until next time, Butterfly Babes, have a wonderful, wonderful day. Remember, I am just simply a girl boss who decided to go for it and you can be too. On that note, I will see you guys in the next one. Thank you.